Hey everyone, it's Cassie from Elementor. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to create a menu that triggers pop-ups. See how a beautiful nearly full-screen pop-up appears on the screen once you click a button. In this case, a menu button. Alright, let's see how the magic is done. In the dashboard, click on Templates, Add New, and choose Pop-up. Name it, and click Create Template. Then you'll get the library, with more than 100 pop-ups to choose from but we'll close it so we can create it from scratch. In the pop-up settings, change the width of the pop-up, switch overlay to hide, and under entrance animation, choose fade in and set its duration to two seconds. Under style, you can design the box shadow settings. Under close button, set the vertical position and change the color and size. In the advanced tab, prevent closing on overlay. This sets where you can close the pop-up either on any part of the screen, or only on the X or the button. So let's get into designing your pop-up. Add a section with two columns, and here choose No Gap. Inside the left column, drag in an inner section widget, and add some padding. Drop in a title widget, and adjust your typography and size. This time I'm going to start off with mobile, so that later I can duplicate it and it will already be all set. Duplicate the title. Note that here we're not using nav menu, just the title to create the menu. Add a button widget. Edit your button's text and style. Color, border, etc. Let's add a margin on the top, also in mobile. Tweak the text size, bottom padding, etc. Now add another intersection. Add some padding. Then inside the intersection, add and design the share buttons. Alignment, size, and custom color. Now let's design the other side. In the right column, the color is changed, but it is only visible once content is added. Add an intersection. Adjust the padding and margin. Drag in a title and design it. Now add a form for users to sign up for the newsletter. We just need their email, so let's delete all the other fields. And fine tune the size, icon, color, etc. To display three products, let's add another intersection. Add padding. But here let's slide hide for mobile to make it visible only on desktop and tablet. Here, a minus margin will shift your column to the left, making it stand out more. Copy the title and paste it. Change the column color to white, border radius, and box shadow. Also on Hover. Drag in an image and go to town. Now go back to the text and change its weight, margin, and duplicate it. Edit the text. Now duplicate the column three times and change each individual margin to create a space between them. Add an image. By the way, notice here that these are GIFs, so you can use video, GIFs, or regular images. Polish your text and set the margins. In Preview, get an idea how it looks. Now design all your items for mobile. Adjust the padding. Increase the VH size to 100 so that the pop-up fits the entire screen. And have some more design fun. Click Publish, and the Conditions window will open. And no changes are needed to the conditions, triggers, and advanced rules. What? Crazy! This only applies to pop-ups that are triggered by buttons. Save and close. Now let's define how you open your pop-up by going to your site's header. Here's a header that was already created. Press the button menu, and in Content, Link, Dynamic, choose Pop-up. 
Click again on pop-up and under action choose toggle pop-up because you want the button to both open and close the pop-up. In pop-up, choose your pop-up and save. On your live page, you can test it by clicking on the button to open and close the pop-up. That's basically it. Want to learn another cool trick? Add some entrance animation to add a real wow to your pop-ups. Back to editing the pop-up. Enchant your users even more by adding entrance animation to each part. Copy these settings to paste the style for each one. Back to the live page. Click the button menu. Whoa! Trippy. What a difference a bit of animation makes. And what about on mobile? Click the menu button. Looks great, too. You can open pop-ups from any kind of button on your page. Give it a spin today using pop-ups in your own creative way.